Hello, everybody. This is Steve Grisetti, co-founder of MoviePicks.com and author of the MoviePicks.com Guide to Adobe Premiere Elements. And here we are in Premiere Elements. And we've got a little problem with an audio file in our project. Now, if you look really carefully at the audio file here on Audio Track 1, you'll notice that there is the normal waveform for audio. However, let me just add another audio file. Notice that normally the audio waveform is on both the left and the right channel. In this particular case, it was recorded with a monaural microphone. This happens sometimes when you use an external microphone plugged into your camcorder. And we only got audio on the left hand side. I'll show it to you here. I'm going to go up to the tools at the top of the menu, open up the audio mixer. And if you watch the audio mixer here, you'll notice that as I play this, you're only going to see the VU meter move for the left track. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. That's kind of a problem. So what do we do about that? How do we get the audio to switch over so that we have audio on both the left and the right channel? To do that, let me just move the audio mixer out of the way right now. We can go over here to the toolbar on the right and select the effects button and go over to audio effects. Here in audio effects, we've got an effect called fill right with left. So in other words, we have audio on our left channel. Applying this, we'll take the audio from the left channel and put it on the right channel too. And we'll have something that sounds a little more like stereo, not true stereo, but at least we'll have audio coming out of both sides. So let's apply that to the track. And now that it's applied to the track, watch the VU meter as I play this file. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. It's a quick and easy fix for when you have a monaural file in your stereo project. This takes the audio from one track, spreads it out over two. A nice, easy, cheesy fix to a perplexing problem. So it's right there, fill right with left, available in the audio category of effects here in Premiere Elements. Now, if you want to know more about Premiere Elements, be sure and check out the many tips and tutorials we have at moviepix.com. If you want to know everything there is to know about Premiere Elements, you want to check out my book. The MoviePix.com Guide to Adobe Premiere Elements. It's available at Amazon.com. I'm the guy who wrote the book. I hope you'll come back and see me again real soon. Take care.